Well, it's the kind of college exam that can end a new career. 18 students from the Wayne State Illich School of Business given the opportunity to deliver their resumes directly to a business leader. Yeah, but there is a catch here. Guy Gordon has a look at this make or break chance. So imagine what these kids are up against. You gotta tell your personal story, talk about your skill set, do something memorable so you connect with the recruiter, and you gotta do it all in 80 seconds on a real elevator in about the time that it takes to tell this story. Hold out your hand. Man. Not sweaty at all. No, I'm not. <laughs> the stakes higher than any letter grade, and they did their homework. I was talking to myself in front of the window. How did that go? It went well. Did you hire yourself? I did. <laughs> I did, I did. Style, important. Substance, even more so. If you want to leave, you know, quality information in and throw out the, you know, unnecessary information. Student number seven, and judge number three. Students. They take three trips with a judge from GM, Ford, Blue Cross, Quicken Loans. Passion. So tell me about your passions. Tell me why, why was this your passion? Why did you choose this realm of expertise that you want to pursue? Hi, good morning. Started buying and selling phones. My mom lost a lot of money in share market. So since that day, I wanted to learn how stock valuation works. So I'm ready to begin my career in marketing. Thank you for your time. In recent studies, communication skills are the number one missing ingredient in today's grads. Soft skills more highly prized than technical ability. They'll be using uh, these skills the rest of their life. Okay. Okay. Five finalists enter a shark tank, three come out winners. And in first place, Andrew Barr. There were cash prizes and, of course, bragging rights, but that's not really what's important here. They got valuable experience. They got to talk to recruiters and network. They linked in online and did the social networking thing. All very valuable to anybody looking for a job. And the most impressive thing? They did it with this elevator music going on in the background. From the Ren Set, I'm Guy Gordon, Local 4. That's right. When you're practicing your elevator pitch, make sure you plan have for music. Background too. It'll music. Be there. It's right. not an easy thing to do. Oh, no, no. That no, is impressive. No, no. Great drill. Yeah.